When I tell you that this was the catalyst for change for me, I'm not exaggerating because it gave me that little glimmer of hope, that little voice inside that said, maybe I could do this. My name is Renee Paulson and that big guy in the back, well, that's Meatball. Don't worry, Meatball, I got this. <laughs> and I've lost over 120 pounds without surgery or medication and helped countless others lose weight and feel fabulous. But this was not always the case. I struggled with my weight for over 30 years and having a healthy balanced diet, I had no idea what that meant. I was that quintessential kid that was raised on processed food and everything else followed suit. I drank a two liter of Coca-Cola every single day and no water. My kids would go to bed smelling brownies baking to wake up to find that mom had hoovered the entire brownie dish the night before and drank heavy whipping cream from the container. I was scheming for food every single day. And oh, one time my husband went into the pantry and we pulled out a package of double stuffed Oreos. And I started to break out in a little bit of a cold sweat because not only were there two sleeves of that sucker gone, but I had purchased that the day before and had hidden it in the back of the pantry so that no one would find it. And as he stood there in the kitchen holding this pack of Oreos with the two sleeves gone and asking me like, where did this come from? I quickly made up a lie. I was like, oh my gosh, I, I bought that so long ago. It must have fallen back behind everything. And I was so embarrassed and ashamed that I was at the point where I was hoarding and hiding food and lying about it. I wish I could tell you that this is the part of the story where I was like, maybe I should do something about that now, <laughs> but it's not. Nope, and it wasn't until years later I was leaving the gas station after buying a pack of cigarettes and a Twix bar, and I was making a left-hand turn over double solid yellow lines, which you're not allowed to do in case you need a refresher on your driver's manual. And I was T-boned on my driver's side. None of my airbags went off. I broke my back, my sacrum, my hip, my head went through the window. I had a brain bleed. It was a whole situation. And up to that point, I had not ever been into a car accident like that. I was like, shook when I, I was like, oh my God. Now I also wish that this was the part of the story where I could tell you that I was like, maybe I should do something about that now, but it's not. At the time I was completely focused on recovery. I literally showed up to physical therapy and I told them that I had a three and a half year old and a seven year old at the time and that I did not have time for this shit anymore. So I needed to speed up this process and let's go. <sighs> yeah, they looked at me like I was crazy, but you tell a woman that she's crazy and guess what you're gonna do? You're just gonna get results because after 12 weeks, I got the green light, I was recovered. I checked myself out of all of my doctor's offices, including pain management, and that's when shit started to hit the fan because my pain and inflammation in my body was so high that I felt like I was constantly running around on a pain level of like a 7.5 to an eight out of 10 all the time. Now also at the same time, my husband was like knees deep into Netflix documentaries and had the brilliant idea that if we went totally plant-based for a little bit, that we would feel so much better and that I wouldn't be in pain. And I promptly looked at him and was like, what am I going to eat? I'm going to eat salad and air. Now he did sell all these great health benefits. And I was going to reduce my pain and inflammation and feel so much better. But really he said three words and I was like, oh, and that was quick weight loss. And I was like, all right, I'll play your little game. Let's see what we got here. And let me just tell you that I made it three days. Okay. I went to McDonald's and I'm ugly crying. I'm ugly crying and I'm having almost like a full panic attack and like the snivels <laughs> like that. And I'm driving to McDonald's like angry. <clears throat> and it was almost like two sides of my brain were battling. One side was like, we are going to get this cheeseburger. And the other side is going, why, why, why do you feel so strongly about this cheeseburger? <laughs> and I remember getting to McDonald's and I, I started circling the McDonald's. 
And these people, I mean, I looked like a crazy freaking lunatic, just ugly crying. And I was driving around the McDonald's and I was dipping in the drive-thru and dipping out of the drive-thru. It was like Dr. Jekyll, Mr. Hyde. It was like, you get the cheeseburger. And it's like, no, don't get the cheeseburger. And I remember just going, what is happening? Like, what is going on? And I ended up, I dipped out of the drive-thru and I drove home. And I ran into the bathroom. And I just started sobbing and I was like, what is going on with me? Like, what? why do I feel like I don't even have any self-control over myself? Like, and really, it comes down to the fact that food and beverage manufacturers are adding this shit to practically everything. Don't believe me? Start going down the grocery store shelves and pulling and looking at the ingredients list. Almost 80% of the food on the shelf has added sugar in it. And this is one of the biggest reasons why losing weight can feel like an uphill battle on roller skates. Ugh, the frustration when you're struggling to lose weight, you feel like the munchie monster is taking over every night. And when you do put food in your mouth, you feel like you gain weight right away. You're exhausted, busy as hell, to running around taking care of everyone else, stressed, Maybe on top of that, you're in perimenopause or menopause, which is making it even harder to lose weight. Maybe you also have a slower metabolism, PCOS, thyroid issues, and you're just done. And what you need is someone who's been there and done it to show you the way. Once I figured out that food manufacturers were putting sugar into everything so that we would be addicted to it and want their products even more, even if we didn't want it, I got pissed. Mm -hmm. because I don't like to be told what to do and I don't like to be tricked into trickery, which is what that is. So I was gung-ho. I was like, I'm going to do a sugar detox. And I decided that 10 days, that was my Goldilocks day. That's the time that I was going to do and I was ready. I started and I promptly failed. Mm -hmm. Failed like putting butter on a Pop-Tart. Failed. It was because I was completely unprepared. I had no idea what I was looking for, and I honestly was like, well, I mean, they're adding it into everything, so I don't know what I'm going to eat. So I mustered up my strength to go at it again. And let me just tell you that on day 10, when I made this all the way through, I was shocked. I was shocked. Not only was I shocked, my husband was also shocked. Meatball would have been shocked, but he wasn't alive back then. And the reason, not only did I lose weight, yes. I had energy like crazy, yes. My skin cleared up, yes. My hair got softer, yes. My eyes got clearer, yes. That's not all the shocking things. The most shocking thing is that on day 10, my husband asked me, he's like, okay, you can have a treat today. What are you gonna have? And I was like, <gasps> I don't know. I don't really want anything. Like, I know I can have a treat today, but I'm not craving anything. Nothing really sounds good. Like, mm, I'm not really sure. And I was like, who am I? What? I can have a treat today and I don't already have one, two, and three things named. I got a backup for the backup for the backup. What? What's happening? He didn't believe me, so he tried it. Same result. Then I started teaching my friends how to do it. Same result every single time. Not only do you lose weight, but you come out feeling fabulous. And I'm talking like fabulous, like back in your 20s when you were ready to go to the club at 1030, like, woo! Yeah, that kind of energy. I knew that so many more people had this problem and that I could help them, which is why I created the 10-Day Sugar Detox. So let me ask you, are you tired of the yo-yo dieting cycle? Done with feeling frustrated of trying to duct tape this thing together and figure it out on your own? Ready for someone who's been there and done that to show you the way? I mean, think of the possibilities. Think of how amazing you could feel in just 10 days. How much more confident you're gonna come out feeling that you can do this. That munchy monster is zipped up tight, sitting down in the corner, so that you have that breathing room and that opportunity to go after and achieve your health and weight loss goals.
the 10 day sugar detox is not only going to help you detox from sugar, but it's also going to give you the knowledge and tools behind how to do that successfully and also how to continue crushing your health goals like the warrior that you are. One of the first things that you're going to learn in the 10 day sugar detox is how to look at food for its nutritional value. That way you can tell if a food is going to kick up your cravings or keep them crushed for the day. All right, so what is it exactly? Well, the 10 day sugar detox is an online program with yours truly as your teacher, where I'm going to walk you through how you're going to successfully complete a 10 day sugar detox. Not only that, you're going to get tons of knowledge and tools in daily bite sized information, like how to get your warrior mindset locked and loaded. What's the difference between fruit and fruit juice, fake sugar versus real sugar information on keeping your inflammation low, all sorts of goodies like that. The 10 day sugar detox is not a meal plan that is given to you. I do have a recipe book that you can get, but I'm not going to tell you what to eat, boo. That's for you to start deciding. To enroll in the 10 day sugar detox, you're going to want to go to www.renepaulson.com forward slash the 10 day sugar detox. You might be there already. And then you can scroll down below this video and you'll see a button that says ready to enroll. Let me just tell you that the value of this program is actually insane. That's because I give you lifetime access, boo. Mm -hmm, that's right. That means you can come back and repeat it as many times as you want over the course of your lifetime. But if you really want to get in and stack numbers, mm -hmm, the average woman spends about $733 per year on weight loss products, programs, the whole shebangy bang. Now let's say you got about 40 years left of you because the average woman's lifespan is about 81 years. We're talking $30,000 spent on weight loss products, programs, pills, the whole lot of it. Instead, today you can join the 10 day sugar detox with lifetime access for as low as $197. And there's no risk with my money back guarantee. Some of the incredible bonuses that you're going to get when you enroll in the 10 day sugar detox is not only instant access to all sorts of tools and recipes, but also an amazing online community of warriors that are just like you. So you ain't doing this alone. Now it's time to make a decision. You have to decide, do you want things to be different? Do you want what's possible? If you do, then today's the day. For those of you that have decided to take action today, here's what you're going to do. You're going to click the button below this video that says ready to enroll. That's going to take you to a page where it's going to allow you to choose your payment plan. And once you do this, you're going to be able to log in and have instant access, take out your credit card and fill out your credit card information. And remember, there's no risk with my money back guarantee. As soon as you click confirm, I want you to check your email and go ahead and add me as a contact. That way I never get lost in spam and I can let you know all of the goodies that are coming your way. I am so excited for you and I cannot wait to hear about your incredible results. Go ahead and click the button ready to enroll and I'll see you in there.